Reliance not only set higher benchmarks of serving the community, but also created business value and societal value on an unparalleled scale. Reliance's exports grew a massive 75% to cross 250,000 crores. We accounted for nearly 8.4% of India's merchandise exports in the year, up from 6.8% last year. During the year 22, Reliance continued to be the largest taxpayer in India. Reliance's contribution to the national exchequer by way of various direct and indirect taxes increased 38.8% to 188,012 crores. Reliance also set new records in creating jobs for Indians. Reliance added 2.32 lakh jobs across all its businesses, with Reliance Retail becoming one of the largest employers in the country. Friends, let me start with our digital services business, Geo. Over the past year, Geo has further consolidated its position as India's number one digital services provider. Today, we have 421 million mobile broadband subscribers on our 4G network, and they consume, on average, nearly 20 gigabits of broadband data every month, which is nearly double their consumption from the year before. Inspired by a dynamic Prime Minister, Sri Narendra Bhai Modi Ji's Digital India Initiative, our country has seen the emergence and scale-up of multiple world-class national platforms, which have brought enormous benefits and ease of living to ordinary citizens. Like Aadhaar, a common national identity for 1.3 billion Indians. Like Jandhan, a self-service bank account that has brought financial inclusion to over 460 million unbanked Indians, especially women. Like Rupee, an indigenous payment card network with over 630 million cardholders. And like UPI, one of the most accessible digital payment system with a monthly volume of over 6 billion transactions. Like Ayushman Bharat, providing health coverage to over half a billion Indians. Another example is our Prime Minister's path-breaking Startup India initiative under which India has launched over 73,000 new startups in the last six years. They have collectively attracted nearly $63 billion of investment and contributed to the creation of lakhs of new employment opportunities. And we have the example of how India has used digital connectivity and digital platforms to stay resilient even during the COVID-19 pandemic. With both humility and pride, I would like to state that all these phenomenal accomplishments became possible because Geo built a world-class 4G digital infrastructure at the right time with sufficient capacity and offered it most affordably to every Indian to take India to global leadership. Let me now talk about Geo's fixed line network. 